Hey, 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 this is Beverly. I will not be denied Bozeman. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. I really do appreciate it. I just wanted to drop by today and let you know that it is okay to crawl. And what I mean by that is when you are going through your go through, when life is hitting you upside the head and things are not as they should be or how you want them to be, keep moving. And when I say crawl, I don't mean just like a baby would crawl on hands and knees. I mean like in the military when they have them on, have them going through some type of training, they're on their belly, you know, using their elbows and their feet. You're still moving. When we go through life, we try to dance through life and 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 twirl and skip and hop and jump. But when situations come against us, especially those things. <clears throat> that we have no control over, we tend to sit down and let it attack us, let it take us over. And we listen to those who say, well, you should have done this or you need to do that. And this is this is why it's happening to you. And, and life just continues to go on. Time continues to roll on. And, and we're just kind of stuck. But it's okay to crawl. And when I say crawl, I don't physically mean crawl. I mean, take a look at the part of the situation that you can be grateful for. I know you can't, you might not be able to laugh and act like nothing's going on, which is how some people do act like nothing, you know, nothing's wrong and everything's everything. And, you know, for them, more power to them. But for the rest of us regular people, when life hits us upside the head, sometimes we got to crawl. I'm, I'm going into day three of my crawling. I'm usually trying to walk through life or dance or, you know, do a little a shimmy or something like that. But for the past three days, life has been giving it to me, child. And I, I mean, let me hold it with both hands. But I'm crawling. I'm looking at every part of the situation and I'm finding something to be grateful for. I feel like that when we're going through our go through, as long as we don't sit and whine and complain and shake our fist at God and, and all this other stuff that we do have control over, I think he, he really takes that into consideration. You know what I'm saying? And he's like, okay, they're ready for level two or they're ready for the next phase or I'm going to take some of it off because their attitude is right. And I tell my husband all the time, we don't know who's watching us. Not necessarily like on social media and saying we got all these folks watching us. I mean, in life, not just our kids, but the neighbors or the store that we go into all the time. And no, we can't walk. Well, I don't say can't. Some of us, some of us regular people, we're not able to walk into everybody's life or their situation with that same smile on our face because life will hit you with a one too. And if you wasn't ready for it, you just wasn't ready for it. And, and on those days, I say it's okay to crawl. If you can't smile your way through it, if you can't laugh and go hang out with the folks and you just got to get your mind together because you just like on the verge of losing it, it's okay to be by yourself. Get your mind right. Find those things to be positive about and, and have a grateful attitude. That's what I consider crawling. Some people never crawl, or at least they want us to believe they never crawl. And you know, it is what it is. I can't bash anybody for how they handle their situations, but us regular people, sometimes we need to crawl. And I think it's okay. I think it is okay to sit down somewhere, gather your thoughts, tell folks, I'm not going to go out with you this weekend, or I'm, I'm just not able to, my money is not looking right or whatever. I got to preserve my money for this particular situation that has just presented itself. So I'm just going to be wise about my money. You know, it's whatever form it needs to be in to help you do whatever it is that you need to do. And also know that when you are crawling on your belly, honey, there's going to be some folks who are going to stand directly in your way. As my daddy would say, there's going to be some folks who are going to stand scrap dab in your face and you're going to have to crawl around them to get through. But the point of it is you are still moving. 
don't sit and wallow in it don't sit there or lay there and talk to the folks who tend to stand in front of you and try to talk to you while you're down because they're just a distraction they're just trying to keep you from getting to the goal and it will be this time next year and you will still be in that same old stinking raggedy situation because you had those folks to stand in front of you crawl around them jokers and as you are crawling be grateful for the fact that your arms work and your feet and your legs work and that you can look back and say five minutes ago i was half a mile back down the road it's just it's just as simple as that it might not look like a simple but it is it's okay to crawl and i think that we as people need to stop faking the funk stop acting like we got it all together every single day of the week and stop belittling and bashing and throwing scriptures at people because they are not doing what we feel like they should do i think that's wrong i think that's something that we need to stop doing girl it ain't that bad you just you just ain't doing it right or maybe if it wasn't so mouthy or or maybe if you learn how to budget your money or if you stop trying to hang out with people all the time, stuff like that is, is not necessary. That's what I consider people standing in front of you. If you know somebody's going through that go through and they don't want to talk about it, just, just be okay with it, you know? But I guess if you want to hang out with folks like that, then it is what it is. But anyway, I'm going off on a tangent. So thank you guys so much for stopping by. And I just want to say one more time, it is okay to crawl. It is really okay to crawl. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. I do appreciate it so much. Be sure to release your genius, pull off the impossible every day, and make sure you say your declarations.